Good afternoon. I'm Nicole Austin with your King Sport Chamber, and we have our member spotlight today. I am pleased to be joined with um, by Linda Bambino, who is the CEO and owner of Comfort Keepers. And Linda, tell us a little bit about what Comfort Keepers does, because you guys have a really unique business model, and you're providing some necessary services. So tell us a little bit about what those services are. Well, we can go into the home. You do not have to be a nurse to work for Comfort Keepers, but we go into home and we enhance quality of life for the elderly. It is a really rewarding field to be in, and I love what I do. Yeah. So what kind of things would that be, like grocery shopping, medicine care? Like what kind of services would you provide when you go into their homes? Well, first off, we always provide companion companionship, whether or not it's a little or a lot. Yeah. Uh, we also do light housekeeping, meal preparation, medication reminders, and we'll also help with grooming, bathing, dressing. But yeah. what we do is we cater our plan of care to what the client needs. Yes. Some of our clients need more people to come and help with a little bit of light housekeeping and meal preparation, and then there are some of our clients who their health is declining and sure. they need more assistance. Mm -hmm. They may be uh, not only homebound, but they may be Mm bedbound. And what we are trying to do is to provide the comfort and the care that someone needs. And quality of life, Mm -hmm. you know, there's just not enough to be said about it because we want to help people when they are in their last stages of life to be comfortable. Sure. And, to and be, some people don't have that family support to help no. them with that. And in our country nowadays, we have, you know, families who are here in Tennessee, mm-hmm. but their children, Somewhere adult else. children, are in California. They may be overseas. Sure. They may be in New York. And they have jobs to where they cannot just pick up and leave. Sure. And you've heard about the sandwich generation. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, you've got adult children, and then... We have their parents, and then they have their children, and there's just not enough hours in the day. And we're there with that extra set of hands to come in and and take care of mom or dad and make sure that they have a good day. Absolutely. I love that. I think that's such an important service to offer to the community, and I'm sure you have a lot of people that need that service. If someone wanted to sign up for this Comfort Keepers Care, how do they do that? How do they go about getting on your list and getting signed up to receive care? Well, first off, make a phone call. You will get a live person. <laughs> it's amazing. Sure. You, you will actually get to speak to a person. Then it, we'll tell them a little bit about what we do, ask them what their situation is, how are you handling it now, sure. and then we'll set up a, an in-home assessment, no cost, no pressure, yeah. and uh, come out and see what the needs truly are. Yeah, okay. that sounds and pretty easy. Y- yes, it is. Right now, there is a waiting list due to the fact is that, yes, we are hiring at Comfort Keepers. I was going to ask you about that. Yes. You've segued right into that, so that's yes, great. Yes, yeah. we are hiring because we are getting more phone calls right now than we can actually service. And it breaks my heart yeah. because I want to help them. Sure. And I know that anybody who calls us, they are in need of help. And I'll tell you, you know, this is a little bit non-traditional because when people call us, my philosophy is, is if I can't help them and I don't have the staff, I am going to give them numbers and and refer them to other agencies because... They need the help, Absolutely. whether I can do it or someone else can do it. It doesn't change that they need help. Sure. And it's an important job. And you need help. So if someone is looking for a job, an employment, you guys have some opportunities. How do they go about filling out an application? What do they need to do if someone's interested in coming to work for Comfort Keepers? Well, they can drop by our office between 9 and 3, Monday through Friday. Where is your office? Where are we? Where are we? 1134A <laughs> Moreland Drive in Kingsport. And easy to find. Uh, easy to find. And look for the little white car with comfort keepers on the yes. side. We're on the corner of the building. And uh, we are always accepting applications, even in times that we aren't necessarily in need of employees. Sure. But you don't have to have a nursing license. It, if you have ever wanted to be a nurse 
or you have taken care of family members. Good experience. Great experience. If someone's uh, contemplating going to nursing school or they want to be a CNA, this is the perfect spot. To test that out. Yeah, to test it out. Is yeah. this meant for me? And you will learn so much because our clients have so much information and a rich history. Sounds like a fun job, too. Well, it can be. It can yeah. be challenging. Sure. Uh, it can be frustrating. Yeah. But I love what I do. Oh, you can tell. You can tell that you have a true passion for it, Linda. Well, Linda, I want to say thank you to Comfort Keepers. You guys have been a long-term member of the Kingsport Chamber. You're doing wonderful work. Do you have a website? We sure do. Uh, it is comfortkeepers.com. And when you look it up, uh, we should pop up. And we are Office 354 because okay. Comfort Keepers has over 600 offices. Wow. Okay. And uh, we are here in Kingsport, Tennessee. Tennessee, but we are hiring throughout the Tri-Cities, sure. and we encourage anyone who is looking to make a difference in this world to come by our That's office. A We're a do. team. Yes. We're a team. We're a family, and I take care of my caregivers. My caregivers take care of our clients, and we are all blessed. Oh, absolutely. Well, you are doing beautiful things here, Linda. Thank you so much for taking some time to sit down with me today. Registered nurse turned into owner of the Comfort Keepers um, franchise here in Kingsport, Tennessee. Check them out on their website if you are looking for a job, if you're looking for care, um, and if you just want to give back in your community, this is a great way to make it happen. Thank you, Linda, for joining us today. Oh, thank you for having me. That's and call 423-246-0100 if you need care, someone you love needs care, or you know someone who needs a job. Great. Thank you so much for joining us for this member spotlight with Comfort Keepers. Have a great day.